of the eggs of uh, our turtles here in Queensland. Read more about turtles and encourage your school to do projects on sea turtle conservation. Reduce your use of plastic and dispose of it properly. What goes into our gutters often ends up in our ocean. Find out the number of your local wildlife carer and carry it with you always. Encourage your parents to drive their boat slowly in shallow seagrass and coral reef areas, if you can't go around them. Don't throw tangled fishing line hooks or bait bags into the water and pick up any you see. Don't eat sea turtle meat or eggs when traveling overseas or buy products made from turtle shell. Don't release balloons. Turtles will eat them thinking they're jellyfish and this can kill them. Global warming threatens turtles. Reduce electricity consumption and all other energy use. If you live in an indigenous community where people hunt green turtles to eat, encourage the hunters not to take adult turtles, but to take turtles less than 90 centimetres carapace length. Shade lights so light doesn't shine on the beach. Better still, turn them off. Don't let dogs run loose on turtle beaches, as they can disturb nesting turtles or eat the hatchlings. Promote programs that control feral animals. Wild pigs and foxes destroy many turtle nests and hatchlings. Make sure your seafood comes from sustainable fisheries that use turtle-friendly methods. Hi Sam, it's Lance from Australian Seabird Rescue. Remember that turtle that we uh, got in a couple of weeks ago that you found? Yeah, of course. How is it? Well, he's going really, really well. Fully recovered and uh, he's ready to go. So we can let him go tomorrow if you like. Would you like to come along? Yeah, I'd love to. Fabulous. All right, we'll see you then. Bye. Bye. Okay. What we'll do, Sam, we'll let him go down in here and let him go out by himself. Here it comes. Oh, he's a bigger one. Can I shake his hand? Well, I think it's just fantastic when we let a turtle go like this. I think it's really beautiful. Sometimes we spend a great deal of time with them in care and you think they're going to die every day. And then all of a sudden you let one go out here into the ocean and the one that you let go might just be the one that continues the species on. And I think it's just a really, really wonderful feeling. It's good to know that we can all do something to protect an endangered species. Just hope that she's the one in a thousand that survives. Thank you.